Every year, regardless of global statistics, we feel that our surroundings change. New buildings are built, the number of vehicles on the roads increases, our homes abound in the increasing number of modern equipment, while our rubbish bins are filled with alarming speed. Road vehicles have had an increasingly big impact upon the environment. Solaris, as the manufacturer of buses and coaches, feels special responsibility to protect the environment. Clearly, it's about time to do something for the environment. Looking closely at the world trends in alternative sources of energy, we've decided to expand our range with a new concept of a vehicle. It's the Solaris Urbino Hybrid City Bus. It's a vehicle engineered both with the environment and the customer's budget in mind. Solaris Urbino Hybrid is a result of several months of development work by the Solaris Engineering Department. Still a short time that could not have been achieved without the close cooperation with our suppliers Allison Transmission and Cummins. Solaris Urbino 18 with hybrid drive is based on the existing stainless steel structure as used in the entire range of the Solaris Urbino city buses. To cut a long story short, hybrid drive can be best described as the use of electric motors to assist the operation of the conventional diesel engine, ensuring the diesel's optimum running characteristics. Thanks to a sophisticated control system, the excess power is used to charge batteries throughout the journey. This technology also makes it possible to recover some of the energy during braking, to collect it in special batteries and to use it subsequently during acceleration. The EV drive is the central unit of the hybrid powertrain. It's responsible for effective blending of torque from the diesel engine and the electric motor. This unit comprises two electric motors of its own, two synchronous couplings and three planetary gears. Externally, the EV module resembles a traditional transmission as used in buses and weighs only 417 kilograms. Additional but equally important components of the hybrid drive are batteries positioned on the roof and an inverter. Batteries receive the energy recovered during braking. Thus, batteries require no charging from external sources of electricity. The set of nickel metal hydride battery, NIMH, weighs 437 kilograms and its life is about seven years depending on the bus operating conditions. Another key component of the Allison hybrid system is the DPIM dual power inverter module. Driving a hybrid powered bus does not entail any significant changes in driving technique or bus operation for the driver. It could be said that thanks to various innovative control systems, hybrid powered buses are more driver friendly. The control switches on the instrument panel are identical to the ones used with conventional vehicles. A DNR drive neutral reverse control unit is used to operate the hybrid drive. Service brakes are rarely used in a hybrid bus with deceleration accomplished just by taking your foot off the accelerator pedal. The braking force is adjusted by the DNR control unit which also allows basic diagnostics of the drive system. The main advantage of hybrid power from the point of view of bus operators is reduced fuel consumption and lower operating costs. Significant savings can be achieved due to the fact that brakes are used less frequently. Hybrid power also means that the diesel engine operates in optimum conditions, which means less stress and less wear and tear for the power unit. The driver of a hybrid powered bus enjoys lively performance and ease of steering and control. A significant benefit for the passengers is that they travel in a quieter bus. Solaris Urbino with hybrid drive is the ideal choice for the pioneering operators who value innovation and who expect a steady return on their investment and who care for the clean environment.